Earlier this year, iLearn Academy Charter School announced a change in venue with construction of its permanent facility set to be completed by 2017. But according to Assistant Principal Rachel Alquero, students will actually experience a change in venue much sooner than right expected. Now. Our permanent facility will be in Harmon, but that won't be completed for another two school years. So we don't expect to be in that facility until school year um, 2017 and 2018. And so in the meantime, we've been trying to look for a larger facility, a larger location where we could accommodate more students, where we'd be able to grow um, the program that we really want to implement um, for the school. And so we were blessed that our contractor, Cortec, had a facility um, available that we could look at um, and see if we would be able to use it, and we were. So we are moving to our new location um, in Ukudu Village, right off of Route 3 along NCS Road. So we'll be there for the next two years. We're looking at um, hopefully being in there by August 3rd. Um, that would be our move-in date for the facilities, the office, the teachers to come in and start training and setting up their classrooms. We are still shooting to start our school year on August 17th. Alquero said the new facility provides a host of new amenities. It provides the space that we need. We can accept more students. Um, we'll have our 5,000 square foot playground that we didn't have here um, and a cafeteria that will seat more students. We would have a robotics room for the students to use. We'll also be able to have, we're gonna call it an exploration room for our resource centers. Um, basically just the amount of space that's gonna be given to us we'll be able to utilize to really implement the program that we wanted to here. Another new feature of the Ukudu campus is a space for a community garden. It's part of a new agriculture program iLearn Academy is considering. Agriculture is something that always needs to be um, done and learned and so the students will be able to grow and plant stuff. What we're looking at is using how we'd be able to use technology to form an irrigation system for the community garden to um, be watered and to grow, um, but really it's our first step towards real hands-on learning towards a real-world issue. Alquero said the move will also allow iLearn to accommodate up to 450 students by October 2015 and up to 900 students the following year. Registration is ongoing and parents can call 989-3789 for more information. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Issa Baza.